display let us see some more prime factorization we have two numbers here the first number is 65 so for 65 the prime factorization will start from which number it's a even or odd number it's a odd number because it is ending with 5 We know that the number which are ending with one, three, five, seven, nine are odd. So odd number are not divisible by two. Means two we can't take. When we see three, sum of the digits six plus five is eleven. So it is not divisible by three also. By five we do because it is ending with five. Five one times five. Three. Now thirteen is a prime number. So we multiply thirteen only. So the prime factorization of sixty-five is five into thirteen. But number we have six hundred and sixteen. It's a even number. We will start with two only. What is the half of six thirty? Three thirty. What is the half of three thirty? One. Six, five. Now, as we got a odd number, so we are going to we come to three. Let us see one plus six plus five. Six plus five eleven plus one twelve. It means this number is divisible by three. Three five is a fifteen. Carry one. Three five is a. 15. Now 55 will not go by 3. The next prime number is 5. 11. And 11 is a 11. So the prime factors of 660 we got as 2, 2, 3, 5, Here also we can write like 2 is coming two times. So we can write 2 to the power of 2. When 2 will come two times in exponent, in its power we can write. Two to the power two and three into five to eleven. This is the prime factorization of six hundred and sixty. You try more questions. Thank you.